California's always in the lead. Maybe others will follow that lead, but that's up to those states. But we are very blessed here with beautiful diversity. Do you you'd vote for this law? California Democrats pass a bill to give illegal immigrants up to $150,000 in interest-free home loans. Listen to Nancy Pelosi. The California lawmakers just passed a law. It hasn't been signed by Governor Newsom, but giving um, government assistance to undocumented immigrants to buy houses. Mm -hmm. That's kind of a, a different place than uh, the Democratic Party used to be on immigration, is it not? I'm not going to say that's what the country's going to do, but that's certainly where California is. Well, I, let me just say, immigration had always been a bipartisan issue. I refer you to but the... But not free houses. Well, that's not free housing. It's, it's the American dream being available to more people. But understand this about immigration. The best speech on immigration was by President Ronald Reagan. This is the last speech I will make as President of the United States. I want to communicate a message to, to the country I love. And he talked about the Statue of Liberty and the bat, uh, beacon of hope it is to the world and what America was preeminent in the world because our door was always open and we will cease to be preeminent when we shut the door. Now, that's, I don't do justice to the great communicator. Google it. It's a fabulous speech. And George Herbert Walker Bush continued in that respect for the diversity of America and the rest. Uh, California's always in the lead. Maybe others will follow that lead, but that's up to those states. But we are very blessed here with beautiful diversity. So you'd, you'd vote for this law? Excuse me? So you'd vote for this law? Well, I don't, I, I'm not familiar with oh. exactly what that is, but making the, uh, the American dream of home ownership available to all people is something we have to do for people before who are here now. This is before, before you're a citizen. Hmm? This is undocumented. Hmm? This is for the undocumented. Well, what I would like to do is move them to documented. The fact that we can move them to documented. And one of the best things that we can do for our economy is to pass comprehensive immigration reform. It's back. Yeah. It's back. The searing headache. I, I'm I've sorry. I told you we're going to come back months. up into it's it. It's back watching that video. Um, first off, the American dream is for Americans. For Americans. Maybe Nancy doesn't know that. $150,000, and Bill, who you know, I've come to love and respect Bill, and I like him as a friend, and I'll smoke weed with him whenever he wants, <laughs> which is pretty much the only time I smoke weed. But no, you cannot vote for that. He needs to not soft pedal that. You, he was soft on that. Yeah, like, because come even, on, for man. him to push where he knows it's wrong. 150 grand. When you bought your first house, did the government give you 150 grand for that house? <laughs> give me anything. And, and, and you know what? I don't want it. I don't want it. Like, I've earned yeah, that. You know, yeah. it, that's just, I don't know, it's a different generation, I guess. And she, by the way, she also then just admits the thing. She admits the thing. Oh, yes, I want them to be she legal. She wants to document meaning them. Yes. I want to document them, and I want them to vote for us, and we're going to give Correct. them stuff, so we'll have basically a, a new, this is going to sound harsh, but it will basically be a new system of slavery for a certain set of 100%. people. That is just true. We will give them enough stuff so they will never leave us, and we will own them forever. That, that really is it. She that flat out said it, said the quiet part out loud.